Now, if you look at what we did, we tried to be very subtle. We, we say that this is the sole of an Abarth wrapped in a traditional 500 package. If you look at the exterior design, we blacked out the headlights, we blacked out the taillights. Cool, but subtle. We put the full body kit from the Abarth on it, but no stickers, no stripes, no mirror caps. But we put the Abarth spoiler on it. So again, very, very cool. When you come around the back, you'll see we've got a nice diffuser, but a single exhaust. Again, a sport tuned exhaust, but a little bit quieter. It's not the wide open, full straight pipe exhaust of the Abar. Look at the interior, sport interior, but we didn't go with the race seats. We didn't go with the tight bolstering on the seats. So it's a little more comfortable in the interior. So we think it's the perfect blend of all those products that we have out there. 135 horsepower and 150 pound-feet of torque. If you think about that, that's the torque level that you have in an Abar, not in sport mode. So you know you're gonna have great performance in this car. We're at Concurso Italiano in Monterey, and today we launched the Fiat 500T. We're really excited about launching this car. I think this is really the sweet spot of the 500 lineup. I think it's the perfect blend of all the 500s that we're bringing to market. You know, people don't even realize we have nine different variations of the 500 when we bring the electric car out at the end of the year. And what we did is we looked at what's the sweet spot for the buyer who, who loves the style and the design of the regular 500, but really wants more performance in their daily drive. So we brought the 500T. The 500T is really the sole of an Abarth wrapped in a traditional 500 exterior package. It gives them a little more compliant ride, a little softer exhaust, but all the performance they need with 150 pound-feet of torque. It gives you 35% more horsepower and over 50% more torque. 